everybody in today's video is my June favourites now this is a quite a variety of stuff um yeah it's kind of summer ish kind of not I've got a lot to get through that's just like random bits and pieces so I've got no makeup this time I don't know why because I feel like I've been buying an awful lot but maybe that's just not makeup I'm buying but I have bought quite a lot lately for my holiday that I'm going on in a couple of months so I've been preparing for that <laughs> so a lot of this stuff is just like little bits and bobs so the first thing is actually a moisturiser and I think when I don't know why I washed it on it was really bugging me but I saw it on a TV show and they talked about it and it's the CeraVe moisturising lotion and they talked about using this to get rid of the um, the appearance of stretch marks and cellulose and things like that so I've been using it, it does, it like I don't, it doesn't get rid of them, I think it softens the look of them if the area is hydrated um, so yeah I've been liking this one, this is the for dry to very dry skin and the thing they mentioned is the hyaluronic acid they said if it's got that in it it'll get rid of the appearance um, of them things that you don't want so now I'm going to do the fashion bits now these shoes <laughs> they look a bit worn but actually I've only worn them a handful of times um, but I've mainly worn them for dog walks so that will probably be why I was going to wear them today but they need cleaning so I have picked up from ASOS these grey plimsolls basically um, I was wearing them in just on dog walks hence why they're not looking very clean but these are actually really comfortable um, they're a nice I really struggle with shoes in summer because sometimes you know when you're going out for a day you don't want to be in sandals because it's just like not appropriate wherever you go in to have your toes out I don't know I feel like in crowded places you shouldn't have your toes out because what if you, they get stood on you know in crowded places so yes <laughs> I would get sandals in crowded places plimsolls though these I believe I was watching them for a while they were only, I think they were only 10 or on ASOS and I was watching them to go down the sale and they did, I think they went down to like £8.50 or something so when they did, I picked them up in, I think I'm a size 7 in these shoes so they are the right, right size I mean, one of them is a bit snug than the other I think that's because we've all got, is it one foot bigger than the other? I don't know so yeah, I probably shouldn't have had these so close to my face because they are filthy like I said yeah they go with absolutely everything I love just pairing these with my next item so what I like to pair them with is my raw hem jeans and I'm having to like oh, really pick this up <laughs> so they are just basic blue jeans at the top but they are raw hem so they are a bit fancier and like I said that makes them so much better with like them plimsolls um, because they're more detailed at the bottom you know I've literally got the exact same here yeah, there's the exact same colour and everything the um they're the Ridley ASOS curve jeans I will have them linked below um but this one's just got the raw hem I think they're still like 25 pounds which is what the normal jeans are and I just fancy something a bit funkier because I am very boring when it comes to my clothing and I don't like it I'm wearing quite a funky top actually today it's quite a nice one I mean it's like bat winged and it's got a a tie yeah you get the gist <laughs> and another fashion item which will also go with all them is my new bag and this is from Primark I love this bag it's just it's so pretty although the strap on it I mean it, it obviously goes longer this is just the smallest strap because I like to hold it with this if you don't hold it by this and you have it on the strap then that just just dangles around and I really don't like the look of it just dangling around <laughs> if I really wanted a stylish um, brown bag because like I say I'm really boring I have the exact same handbag all the time for every different occasion so this is just something different and like I said Primark um, maybe is it £8 they have this exact same in black which my sister owns and we both turned up the same day with the same bag just in different colours so what does that tell you uh, what's in here 
Okay, so last time I used this bag is when we went to the Peak District because I've got all these leaflets and a chocolate from the restaurant we went to. Oh my gosh. I really should empty bags out when I finished using them, but that just shows I've actually not used it since then. Because I am busy. I am busy. <laughs> Next thing. I am busy at the moment because I have just got a new job. So I am somebody that absolutely hates change, can't stand change, hate it, hate it, hate it. Um, but after a few issues at my previous work, I didn't get fired, <laughs> I resigned. It's the first time I've had to resign from a job so that was like something else. Um, I've just had my last week there and I start my next job next week which, yeah, when this video goes out it'll be next week, from now it's like two weeks away. Um, I'm just so happy. I'm so happy for this job. It's the job I'm really looking forward to and I just want to get in there and start it already. But yes, try some of the floor. <laughs> um, yeah, so obviously that's a favourite of mine and I will be doing a drive with me on the, my very first day at work. So I will like go through it all with you and talk about it more then. So yes. And something else, right? I snack like there's no tomorrow. Well, actually, no, I don't. I'm not that bad at snacking. But when I do snack, you just pick up stuff what's ever in the house or easy to get hold of when you go to the shops. So I've been trying to find snacks that are good for you, that aren't just fruit. Like, and I found some. I really, 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 really wanted to find some yogurts. Now these are the light and free vanilla vibe Greek style yogurts. So let me just get one out for you. There is one missing already. Oh no, I've just broken the box. Oh wait, there we go. So they're quite a good size, but these are just vanilla vanilla yogurts. These are better for you than usual yogurts. I do like yogurts. I'm just really picky because I hate yogurts with bits in them. And a lot of the light and freeze do have bits in them. That's why I thought the vanilla what would have in it. So, yeah, this is nice and smooth. Um, like I said, I like yogurts, I really do, but they are an absolute nightmare because they've all got bits in them. And I hate the fruit bits in them, it's just the wrong texture. A yogurt should be smooth. It's what we had as children, smooth yogurts, and that is what we should have in adulthood. Yes, smooth yogurts. If you watched my London haul, you will know, no, my, not my London haul, it was my London vlog my last one, you will know what I bought whilst I was in London and it makes me very happy. I love acrylic, I love storage and I love my sunglasses. So these is from Muji. I've wanted this for absolutely ages, ever since Lily Pebbles first mentioned it when she was in the flat. So that was like, ugh, forever ago. Um, she used this kind of storage for her sunglasses. I thought, brilliant, because my sunglasses, if they don't come in a case, You've got nowhere to put them um, with like and they're pretty they're pretty so they need to be you know they need to be stored nicely on display so you can see them oh I mean you could have them like oh that way oh they're all falling fall back but yeah I have my laid out on some other acrylic drawers I have for my um, staples and things but I am doing a dressing room tour hopefully in the next month so you will see how these are set up and where they are placed and whatnot when I do that there we go so I think three two of these pairs are from Primark one is Key Australia the Desi Perkins um so 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 Soraya Soraya they're the Desi Perkins sunglasses which I spent bloody loads on and then these are from Coos, I believe that's how you pronounce it. T O U S. Coos? Cows? Okay, something else is. <laughs> He's my, my wax burner. I wasn't much of a wax burner um, person. I just kind of had. You know, like the plugins and things, they're not very interesting. So, this is my new wax burner. I do have another one, a Yankee Candle one, and an electric one, but this is my pretty one. This is a pretty one that goes in my living room, as you can see the tea light in it, and there at the moment, 
is alien um, like the dupe of the perfume so yes I really like that and I've discovered um, lots of different Etsy shops which do them so I have got quite a few now oh another one I like let me just show you the box should I just show you the box look at all these these are all my wax melts so I really like the airwig ones that come in the bars there's this shop on Etsy Tay Madden so I've got black opium perfume ones um, the unstoppables in fresh I've got prom pomegranate noir which is Gemlo and clean cotton little hats so I really like having a mixture of different things it just obviously takes a while for the, to use them all up what else in here do I have I have some Yankee Candle ones these are the fruity melons I thought these would be quite nice for some time oh yeah And I definitely need to stop spending my money on wax melts at the moment because as you can see, I've got quite a lot. So that is it for my June favourites. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next week for a brand new video. Thanks for watching. Bye.